Hello everybody, my name is Alphamish and today I'm here with another video and today I'm here to talk to you about something pretty massive here So basically this video all I'm going to be talking to you guys about is the portal of power Okay, so basically if you've been wondering how the portal of power works, if you want to sign find it, if you want to know all that stuff Then I suggest you watch this video, okay, so this is something that I've never done this type of thing before So I guess it is science with Alphamish today, okay, so it's pretty amazing So yes, yeah, so you're getting your knowledge from an 8th grade, whatever, okay, so I will continue on Okay, so, um, yeah, so this is basically for my observations, okay, so I kind of know how the system works with the, um, the USB cords and all that stuff. I'm very good with technology, guys, trust me, I know how it works. Okay, so basically, how about we jump right into this with the NFC wire, okay? So how that works, okay, so, it basically, there's a wire that goes around the entire perimeter slash circumference of the portal of power, okay, in the inside of it, okay? So we continue on, okay, this is basically what's inside the portal, okay? So if we were to continue after the NFC, which is the near few communication little adapter thing, then if we were continuing on, we have the wires, which are used for USB connection as well. And then for the chip, okay, that's another thing in there, that is used for the um, USB cord as well, or the USB connection as well. And then we also have the LED lights, I have no idea how those work, so how will we jump right into this with the NFC um, wire, okay, so basically how that works is there's a 360 degree um, little wire thing that goes around the entire portal, basically surrounding anything that gets in there, and basically if you get within the field of communication of it, then it will most likely connect with it if you have like the right chip and it knows if it can recognize if it's registered to know this stuff, then it will connect and then it will be sent through the wires into the chip, which the chip will store all the data and then memorize it, all that stuff with the um, scan, they're also memorizing all that stuff as well, it will do all that stuff, and then the chip will connect to the USB cord, and the USB cord will be sent, uh, will be sending, sorry, all the information into the console, and then the console will be projecting it onto the TV screen, or whatever screen you'd like to call it, for the console, and then boom, it's in the game, it all works, boom, it's just, it's witchcraft, I guess, like, say, no, it's not, I just basically expose it, but yeah, so how about we continue on to the LED lights, okay, so I have no idea how these work, so these are, this is just my prediction, it's really bad prediction, but here it goes, so it's basically, um, the USB cord somehow brings in the power for the LED lights, I'm not even sure how this is physically possible, or, you know how it was in SSA, I know how it would work in SSA, because there were battery packs in there, and I could understand how the energy could have gone to the lights, but I have no idea how it works anymore, so I'm assuming the USB cord, um, somehow, uh, causes some kind of charging thing, kind of like all the, um, consoles did back in the olden days, I didn't really, I wasn't really around in those days, um, but, it was basically, there was a wire connected to the console thing, and you didn't have to do anything, so, I mean, I'm assuming that's probably how it works, it's kind of the same deal, so, I mean, yeah, that's, I guess that's how it works, there's gonna be some kind of power thing that goes through the wires and to the lights, and then they cause this, this amazing thing that basically causes some glowingness, some lights, I'm not really sure how they change colors, though, but, uh, that's just too advanced for me to know, and yeah, so basically, anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching, please subscribe for Cotton Kids Studio, you thumbs up, time down below, if you, um, are interested, if you are just, like, mind blown, if you like my, I don't know what to say, and yeah, so basically, anyways, uh, thank you guys for watching, I hope to see you guys next time in another video.